Hi everyone, and it's 2025. It's been a while since I created a video. In this one, I'll be sharing to you how to use your UE assets into FBX so you can export them into your 3D application. So why export this into your 3D application? Well, really, I don't know. Um, I just ventured into this area because there's this composition that I wanted to do on my Maya application, but I somehow don't have the assets, so I downloaded some at Marketplace. Okay, so let's begin. This is going to be fairly easy. All we have to do is have the assets that we wanted to export into our 3D software. Mine, I'll be exporting this into my Autodesk Maya. And I wanted it to be in FBX format. So if you're wondering where I got this asset at Epic Games Marketplace, you can download it for free. And there are a lot of free assets there. So anyway, all we have to do is go into our content browser and go to your meshes. So right now, these are static meshes. All we have to do is select all the UE assets that we want to export into FBX. So select all those, right click, go to asset actions, bulk export, and then select a place that you want it to be directed. For me, I already created one earlier, but for the sake of showing it to you guys, I'll create a new folder. So this will be Game Fantasy folder and then select folder and then export all. And also we need to export the texture. I'm going to go to texture folder, select the texture and then go to asset action, go to export. And then here inside Game Fantasy, hit save. Is it this one? Yeah. Game Fantasy hit save. And now let's test if it's working so this is what i tried earlier but let's open a new file and then let's go to import here inside game fantasy inside game fantasy game fantasy 3 meshes let's select one probably um big fabulous tree hit import and then there we have it we have an fbx of the tree to complete this let's also apply the texture so Select the mesh, right click material attributes, and then let's look for this one. So right click on the folder. Let's look for the location of the map, T texture, and then hit open. And there we have it. We have exported our UE asset into FBX and we're able to use it inside our 3D application. Again, thank you for watching and see you on the next video.